Pet Simulator X Christmas update is awesome and here, and I already made my first video on it where yesterday I basically, you know, showed you guys what's in the update, but I missed some things because there's so much to cover. Today, we're gonna go over the rest of it. We're gonna get some new pets. We're gonna open some stockings and we're gonna get a huge pet out of this update hype right now. Imagine, imagine I called that. I didn't, I got a party pig. And you can get a party pig too if you like the video and subscribe now. Just kidding, there's no way of getting a party pig. I mean, you could probably get it, but not for subscribing, but hey, like the video, okay? It helps out a lot. Our last video was trending millions and millions of views. I'm just kidding, I don't actually know how to perform yet because I'm recording this before I uploaded it, but you know, millions, let's just pretend. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and hit that notification bell to never miss a video. Uh, I have to say all that stuff because YouTube recommends the videos and stuff. You know, you know how it is, guys. One of the things I did not cover in the first update is the elf on a shelf part of the update. Right here, I just found an elf and I completed it. Wait, that's it? It's only just one elf? Okay. Wow, it gave me a lot of coins. It gave me a lot of coins. So I guess I thought it was like you have to find various elves, but maybe it's just that one. Not really sure. So the elf on a shelf thing, I, I guess I completed that. I guess it's just one elf. I thought it was going to be like a series of elves that you have to find, but that was something that I did not cover in the initial update. So I wanted to make sure I covered that. There's also gifts you can find randomly around the map. And there's also this advent calendar, which the next reward these aren't very useful what's going to be useful is this christmas booth that's going to be really cool because it'll be like this limited christmas booth that like kind of stands out when you go to sell stuff overall though the update i thought has been really really good the christmas part 2 update's going to come out soon and it's going to add a quest to get this rudolph reindeer hoverboard which would be cool i also did pick up the hardcore tech hoverboard finally so shout out to those of you who told me to get that i finally got it but yeah i think the elf on a shelf thing is literally just that elf so what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be opening a bunch of stockings we're going to be trying to figure out how this end north pole area works like what is what is this all about i'm assuming this is a hardcore mode only thing so we're gonna have to figure out like how to get through to hardcore but in the meantime we can also buy some stockings this also is happening right now santa paws is delivering gifts and huge chance visit the christmas world in seven minutes so in seven minutes he's gonna be delivering stuff which is gonna be pretty cool and we should probably do that in hardcore mode i'm assuming so another huge feature that they added is the gift feature and i it's honestly one of the best features they've ever added it's kind of like the bank except you can send someone a gift without having to like access their bank and it's basically just cross trading honestly because you can send someone a gift and they don't even have to send you one back or accept it oh no it's disabled so something must have happened where they disabled gifts it must be like broken but i just wanted to point out like in the last video i did i have 100 out of 100 gifts and every time i claim it instantly goes to 100 there's probably like tens of thousands of you guys sending me gifts right now which is so sick and nice of you so thank you very much i appreciate it let's go ahead and go over to hardcore mode so we can go to the Christmas world there because it's going to be more valuable. And this Santa event in six minutes will probably give us some benefit. Um, th This six minute thing, like if we if we do it in hardcore mode and we can get some really good pets there, we can make some progress. I'm assuming that question mark end thing in the North Pole is only going to be hardcore mode accessible, but I'm not really sure. Let me know if you guys have figured it out or if you've made it there. So let's teleport to the Christmas area in hardcore. Again, I haven't made it through Pixel Forest or the Cat World, but but we can at least go to Wonderland because it's an event, baby. We don't have to do anything else. We don't have to. We don't have to get rainbow coins. I'm excited about that. Is there an elf on a shelf here? No, there's not. Okay, so here we are in the hardcore mode. Again, we don't have that good of pets in hardcore for this exact currency because they don't have like a gingerbread currency thing. So it's just a, a tough grind, honestly. It's just like it's just a tough grind. That's that's all there is to it. Actually, wait, can I server boost in here? I can, right? I can go to the void and server boost with the coins and stuff. That'll at least make things a little bit better. As long as it applies to gingerbread. There we go. That's pretty nice. So we got triple damage and we got the super lucky. So those are going to be pretty helpful. Let's go back to the Christmas world and see, hopefully those apply. But again, there's no pets that have gingerbread like enchants. So we're just going to have to do it the old fashioned way. And again, hardcore mode is just that much harder than the other one to grind through. So it will definitely take a longer, a longer grind for sure. Oh man, hardcore mode is so hard. Why do they always got to make it so hard? I mean, it makes sense. It's in the name, but yeah, getting through here 1.2 million. I honestly think it should be cheaper in hardcore because it's so much harder to get coins. Like, look at this, bro. It's going to take me like 10 years. So we're obviously not going to make it through to the final zone in this episode. So I think I'll just spend the rest of the episode just buying a bunch of stockings because that is all I'm good for. This event only stocking gift, you can buy 10 at a time 
You can get this huge uh, Christmas cat and huge Christmas dog. I think they're called huge elf cat and huge elf dog, actually. But I haven't gotten those yet. So I'm going to basically buy like 100 or how however much I can buy to fill my inventory. And we're going to go ahead and get ourselves these huge pets. I'm trying to remember, complete the huge pet index. I, I basically have all the pets in the game. There's some pets I'm missing, a lot of dark matter pets I'm missing. But these huge pets, I really want to make sure I always have completed. And there's so many that I don't have now. So these are two that I need to knock off my Christmas list. <laughs> LOL. And like the video and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? They always say, you know what they always say, like the video and subscribe. <laughs> All right, let's get 50 for now because I don't know if my inventory is kind of almost full. So we're going to go ahead and all these Christmas stockings, we're going to go ahead and open. I'm kind of scared, bro. I really don't want to fail here. I don't want to knock out a huge. Oh my gosh, right away. What? Right away. And this is without the huge chance that Santa's about to bring. Apparently, he's about to bring like extra huge chance. So we just got a huge elf cat, gifts too, nothing crazy. That is massive. Okay, now we need the cat. What do we need the dog? So we have the cat. We need the dog. It's the only huge we're missing out of this. I can't believe we already got that. Is anyone saying anything? I'm gonna say hi. Oh, they're like, dang. <laughs> and I'm number 97 on the leaderboards, by the way. So I'm kind of like knocked off the leaderboards. Oh my gosh, no way. We got the cat and the dog. That is so, that's actually so lucky. That's actually so lucky that we got that because I was like worried we were gonna get a cat again. I just got the huge cat and the huge dog. That is awesome. And it's, this guy, Santa Paz is apparently gonna deliver gifts and huge chance in the Christmas world. But I just got two huges in only 50 stockings. That's not bad. That's actually not bad. So here's our new huge pets right there. The huge elf dog and the huge elf cat. Again, that's gonna be two off the index. I am excited about that. That is huge. Literally, that is huge. No pun intended. All right, let's go to the end here and see these huge pets. So if you look right here, we got Easter cat we're still missing, tie-dye cat, and some of these other purchasable exclusives that I can't get again unless I trade for them. They're all like toy codes and stuff and huge. Or these are uh, plushy codes. I can't get those again. But I just got these. I did not have these, and I just got these. Santa dragon, Santa monkey. Wait, what are all these? Wait, what are all these? Okay, so the huge jolly penguin is this one, right? I think that's the huge jolly penguin. But what about all these other huge pets? Like, what about all these other huge pets? Are they like plushies that are coming soon? What the heck are these other huge pets? All these Christmas ones, like the reindeer dog, Santa monkey, Santa dragon. Are these all going to be like, plushies? Because I don't see them. I don't see where they could be. I'm assuming they're going to be plushies. That's pretty cool, I guess. Okay, so let's go ahead and open before this Santa pause comes here. Let's go ahead and open about 50 more stockings. Maybe we can get some more huge pets and then he's going to be here bringing us better huge chance and gifts. Also, I'm a little bit sad that the gift feature seems to be not working right now because it's such a good feature. If you guys haven't used it yet, basically you can send gifts to anyone by just typing in their username and they'll just get them in their gift inbox. And you can claim gifts up to 100 in your storage at once, and then they fill up at 100. But once you claim more, you can get more. So it's so funny because I probably have way more than 100 being sent to me right now based on how full this is. And every time I like it's not working right now, but every time I was claiming, it would just instantly go back to 100. So shout out to you guys going crazy with the gifts. You do not have to do that, but I appreciate it. And if you have any super rare pets you want to give me, I mean, I wouldn't be mad. All right, check out these stockings. We are about to go ham and open even more. Should I wait for the huge chance? You know what? Let's wait 15 seconds or 17 seconds because I don't know what's going to happen in this 12 seconds. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know if like the game is going to update again or if something is just going to happen here. I, I don't actually know what's happening. Three, two, one, shoe nice. Visit the Christmas world now. Okay, so I'm here now. So what does this mean? Like, wait, is he? Oh my God. No way! Look at that! No way! That is sick. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is sick. So this is really good for uh for the the uh coins. Oh, so he's gonna go through the whole world, but I can't go past this. Oh, that's so unfortunate. I need more. I need more coins. I need more gingerbread. Oh, I'm getting rainbow coins for the redeemables. That sucks. So it's gonna be hard to get through here, but he's still dropping gifts and I can't get them. Oh, this is so unfortunate. But that's kind of sick. I like that. I like that. So he's on a timer probably. And I don't know if he's gonna visit often, but I really like that idea that he's just gonna come through and it's like a live event kind of thing. And he just drops a bunch of stuff. I like that. I definitely like that. So let's go ahead and open the rest of these stockings. We already got these two huge pets. There's a huge chance for what? Yeah, I don't, I don't know what the huge chance does because it doesn't seem like it's given me better huge chance. Maybe you have to collect the huge chance luck. I'm not sure how that works. Maybe he drops an actual potion 
that's like huge luck or something like that. I'm not really sure how that happens. But if you guys got the huge chance luck thing from Santa, let me know because I'm curious how it works. We opened all the stockings. We just have two more. And out of the first 50, we got two huge pets. We got the two unique huge pets, which is what we needed. And this time we got none. So kind of sad about that, but it's not a big deal because we already have all the huge pets out of that update or out of that uh, stocking. But now we need to grind out this hardcore mode. It is going to be an actual grind because in the other zone, in non-hardcore, you get through here so fast. And in hardcore, obviously it's harder, but it's it's much slower, much, much slower. So definitely going to take a bit. Also, I wish there was an easy way to do VIP servers in hardcore mode. I think there is. I think like there's like a loophole of how to do it, but I wish it was just normal. Oh, he's back. He's back. So he goes through that way and then he comes back this way and we're going to get some more gifts. Okay, big, big, big gifts, big gifts, big money. Yup, yup, yup. Come on. Give me some more. You know what would be sick is if all the gifts he dropped in these other zones. Wait, does he keep going? Does he keep going? Oh, imagine you get on him. <laughs> okay, he just gave me a bunch. So that helped a lot. Imagine if so if I break through this wall, are all the things that he just dropped in there? Like if they're still in there and I can still get them and they don't disappear, that's going to be big. But it seems like he is actually leaving now, but he but he kind of rotates twice. So he gives you a really good amount of uh droppables. It's a good feature. I like that. You definitely want to take advantage. Someone in the chat's like, "Let me with you you let me get on with you all right um we're kind of like halfway through this zone but man it is way grindier and hardcore let me tell you what like it's definitely grindier and especially because there's other players breaking things as well you get like less of the percentage of the coins so i just need like a big like 100 times chest that would be pretty big that would be pretty useful and it's unfortunate because the redeemables gifts up here they give me rainbow coins they don't actually give me the event coins if i'm in here so i was hoping i could take advantage of that but you can't you gotta just do it the old-fashioned way so it's still pretty nice that they have this in hardcore but i wish it was a little bit easier but of course it's hardcore mode that's how it's gonna be so i'm gonna go ahead and click away until we get to 1.2 million so we can at least go through the next area but seriously if you've made it all the way to the north pole in hardcore can you interact with that huge cat how does it work can you buy it how, how does it work i'm very curious if it's worth going all the way to the north pole in hardcore because maybe that's what they want you to do maybe they want you to get all the way through the end and then you're allowed to buy it for like gingerbread coins or robux or something like that i'm not really sure how, how they're doing it but i got all the new, i got the two new stocking huge pets there's a bunch new huge plushies coming gifts are still broken sadly which i wish i could use them but they're alas broken at the moment but we will make it through and i'll see you guys in the next zone hopefully okay this took 18 years but finally I can afford this next zone in hardcore. What does that even do for me? Honestly, not much. Santa's presents aren't here anymore. It genuinely didn't do that much for me. I mean, I can get coins at a faster rate in hardcore now from this zone. So I guess that's good. But man, it is hardcore in this area to actually get gingerbread tokens. It's definitely pretty tough because you can't get them from the gifts up top. It's, you know, it's definitely going to be a little bit harder in hardcore, obviously. But if you guys make it to the end and there's something to do with the North Pole, please let me know. I did get the super rare huge pets in this episode. I did get myself through one zone in hardcore, at least. And I really wish gifts were working because I would claim and send some gifts. So uh, all that's left to do is really buy a few more stockings. We already got some huge pets, so I'm going to go ahead and... Actually, how much are the stockings worth right now? You know what? I'm just going to buy a few more. I'm going to buy 20... Actually, I can't buy 20 because I don't have enough slots. But I'm going to buy 10 more, and we'll see if we get ourselves a huge... Make sure you like the video and subscribe if you're new, if you haven't already. Again, huge shout out to everybody supporting the channel lately. All the videos... Like, I've been doing only one video a day, and it's very different. I've done two a day for a long time. But the one video a day, I've been really liking a lot more. So again, smash that like button, subscribe, all that good stuff. It really helps out and lets me know you guys are enjoying. But here we go. Here's an open eight. Nothing shiny, though. We did get a shiny elf dog. I will take that. Okay, what do we got out of here? No huge. We got a shiny exclusive. We got some rainbow exclusives. And we got ourselves the two huges. I will take that. There's an elf cat to end it, but nothing better sad is there any other huges out of these eggs i don't think there is right yeah so all those huge pets are either found from this egg that's the huge jolly penguin or or one of them then the huge the two huge pets that i got out of this stocking and then there's the huge pets that are from plushies but some of them i don't think are so like these are plushies i believe but this one the jolly penguin is out of that egg i believe and then is there any other ones the huge santa dragon i'm confused because wait is the huge jolly penguin the one at the end there 
I gotta check real quick. I, I don't remember. No, maybe it's the one right there. Maybe it's the one in this uh, snowman egg. I'm not really sure. Either way, there are some huge pets to be found and we will do our best to get there. Tomorrow, we get to claim 5 million in the advent for hardcore. That's gonna be pretty big for hardcore mode, but getting 35 million is another story. So just let me know if you guys got to the end of this. Smash that like button if you haven't already. Subscribe if you're new. We opened hundreds of stockings and we got the new huge Santa pets. So, uh, or the huge elves. So I will take those huge elf dog whoops and huge elf cat and we'll remove this guy. There we are. So pretty decent day of opening. Like the video, subscribe if you know. I'll see you next time. Watch another video while you're at it. Should be down here, here.